the cups and balls. Okay. <laughs> Three cups. These cups are pretty cool. They can actually pass right through each other. Watch this. Cup number two goes right through cup number one. And cup number three can go right through cup number two. Isn't that cool? Cup number one goes, uh, sorry, I get stuck every now and then, sorry. <laughs> Anyways, it's three cups and three little balls. There's one, there's two, there's three, and, um, oh yes, the magic wand. Okay, three balls, three cups. We'll take ball number one, here we go. Place it into the hand, give the wand a little bit of a spin, it's gone. Ball number two goes the same way. There we go. Into the hand like this, a spin, gone. And ball number three, the same way. A spin, not yet, <laughs> so gotta watch. Ball number three, a spin, and gone. But they all jump right back into their cups. Here, we'll do it again. We'll, uh, in fact, this time, let's go a little step further here. We'll uh, place the balls back inside their cups. Watch this. I can make ball number two invisible. Where would you like it to go? Cup number one or cup number three? Cup number three. Three? Watch. There it is. It's jumped from here and reappeared over there. Now, that was a little fast, I admit. So here, let's, let's back it up a bit. Okay. Once again, we'll take ball number two. Invisible. And this time, place it over there. Just like that. All right, now that was a little fast, I admit. So, uh, you know what? Let's back things up a little bit. I'll show you exactly how this trick works. See, now the whole trick is there's actually a little hole in the bottom of the cups. See that? So you can go right through there. I'm kidding, I'm just joking. <laughs> you really can't. Watch. We'll take this ball and we'll go right through. Oh, sorry. So let's try it again. We'll take this ball and go. Oh, there we go. It passes right through the cup. See that? Pretty crazy, huh? So, in fact, we'll have it join those two down there. Tell you what, let's slow things down a little bit. Ball, ball, ball. Cup, cup, cup. We'll place a ball underneath each one of the cups. Did you want to check them out first? <laughs> okay. A ball underneath each one of the cups. We'll set the wand aside so that, that doesn't confuse you at all. I'll take this ball out of the way. Make it a little bit easier for you. Into the pocket. I'll take this ball out of the way. To make it really easy for you. In fact, I'll take all three balls out of the way. To make it really easy so now you can't be confused at all. Into the pocket. You know what happens? Well, they come, uh, they come back. See, this one came back. <laughs> but don't feel bad because uh, that one came back too. But the really cool part is this one came back too. But don't feel bad because even though they all came back, you're going to help me with the last part. Take the magic wand here. I want you just to tap one of the cups. Tap, tap. Tap away, go ahead, whack it, wail on it. Oh, just once. You, you can't tap it more than once. See, if you tap it three times, well, oh, then you get this big ball at the end. And that's just not right. In fact, since you tap three times, we get a big one there and a big one there. <laughs> and uh, you know what, for the big finish, you get one more right about there. And that is the cups and balls.